Hi, welcome to another Launchbox video. Hopefully today we'll give you a bit more of a, a look at Neo Geo CD. Uh, by request of uh, one or two people who have asked about this uh, attack, obviously this is for you more so. Uh, right, are we ready? Right, best place to start with is where you keep your Launchbox. Mine's on an external hard drive. Click it in uh, and then go to your games just for attack really more so you asked me about this what type of format are your games in uh, well the answer to that question is there they're in CCD sub uh, disk image with a Q and I obviously can't tell you where you get those but that's the format that they come in for RetroArch so the next thing you need to do is exactly as I've just said go to RetroArch so load up in your emulator, load up the EXE for RetroArch before you do anything. And I'll do that now. Bang, load up. Uh, once you're on your RetroArch, just go across uh, to uh, da -da -da -da, online updater. Core downloader. Once you're in your core downloader, go down the S's, pass the Sega until you get to SNK Neo Geo CD which will come anytime soon there we go Neo Geo CD once you click it once it'll automatically update load use your back button to come back out of there close RetroArch down so come out of there main menu quit RetroArch that's it done so next thing you need to do is move into uh, your launch box so we'll start launch box very quickly launch box duh, 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 exe start up And this is 12.3 version, so that's where I'm filming from. Minimalize that, we don't need that anymore, but just in case, I'll let you see what's behind it. Uh, right, so, oh, ignore that, because that's a future video coming up, PSV Vita. Uh, so hit the subs button and like button, uh, and you'll be aware of when that turns up, I'll have done the video for it. So, right, consoles, there we go. Neo Geo CD. I'll show you a game quickly working and then I'll quit it. Uh, so we'll say uh, a game I enjoy a lot of Baseball Stars. I do enjoy playing this. And this is how it loads. Double click, away you go. And that's just this console file loading if you want to. And it goes to this menu inside. So all you do is press start on the menu. Make sure your joypad is configured. Press start. Bang. One out. Baseball stars two. All right. We'll press on with the uh, install the emulation. Right. Go to tools. Manage. Emulators now RetroArch now with with uh, Launchbox 12.3 actually installs most of this for you now. So all you need to do is click RetroArch, edit. Ed you don't need to touch details. Associate platforms. That's all you need to do. Associated platforms. Click in there. I've already done mine, as you can see. Just click in there, double, and then from the drop-down bar, Neo Geo CD as easy as that then click once you've done it click like i have done default emulator and that's it that's pretty that's pretty much it click ok done and then close and then once you start doing your import of roms which is tools import rom files click next add folder go to games where you're keeping your neo geo games Double click, or you don't even have to, you don't have to highlight it, and then click select folder, click next, highlight the SNK Neo Geo CD, with the, click next, it'll already be RetroArch, but just in case, from the drop down menu, click RetroArch, leave the games where they are, and would you like to download metadata, click next, and then it'll do the metadata, which is all your box art, info, game save screens and everything i'm not going to finish it because i've already done mine i don't want to mess my system up so i'll cancel that but once you do that it'll scan with the load bar in 
as easy as that. Uh, one last game I always enjoy doing. I'll just show you very quickly something uh, that's uniquely Neo Geo. Uh, bum, 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 bum. What should we do? Oh, Metal Slug. Metal Slug. Love it. Load Metal Slug up. Press start. And you can play Metal Slug to your heart's content. Okay. Mission 1, start! before we get too carried away. Uh, the only one thing you may need to do, just in case you haven't done it, is in your retro arch, you will need these to put these bios. That's the raw. You need to get them off of Google. That's the folder. Once you've got that folder, that needs to go in retro arch, system, and that's all your bios. Drop it, drop that into there. Just to make sure that you've got the BIOS for the OGO CD ROM. But that's what the folder is called that you need to download for the BIOS. Other than that, we'll leave you to it, let you enjoy. Any comments, any question, please do ask. Any help you need, please do ask. Stay tuned for more on coming soon the PS, PS Vita uh, with the launch box. Take care.